ladies and gentlemen, we have some work to do. It is time, it is time, it is time. And you guys already know, I told you I would be doing this video later on in the day. That should free up that tomorrow. We could possibly do a guide on him or we could do Basker. You guys let me know. I know a lot of people are actually interested in Basker and what he does. And I know this is a brand new character, so I know you guys might be more interested immediately on him and most people are gonna summon for him. Basker's in the guild. So either people just pick them up and don't really need to use them on anything. And you know, they're, and they're both dark. Just one is an attacker, the other one is a defender. So all up to you guys, let me know in the comment section. I really would love to know which guy, what you would prefer first. They're both coming, but just let me know which one you prefer first. So let us, uh, without further ado, let's get a rinky dinky do. I'm gonna turn the volume up and we are going to get into some summoning. All right, guys, so here is the lovely banner. It is Claude, Edwin, Ruby, and then Andrian. I feel, is, I feel like it is Andrian, it's not Adrian. It could be Adrian, though, um, but yeah, no, it is Adrian. God, I'm gonna get slaughtered in the comments. Yeah, it is Adrian because there's no N, and, like and, it's Adrian. So yeah, Adrian, Adrian, I don't know. Please forgive me. So, I almost feel like full pulling on this. I know Aurora was cool, you know, but I didn't feel like full pulling on hers. I haven't full pulled in a long time, but I kind of hope that I do get some Ruby dupes. Claude is up right now, and that would be nice to get some dupes in him. He hasn't really gotten any play, and Edwin would be, would be pretty decent, in my opinion. So, right now, I do think that for at least Ruby, I would hope that I'm gonna get some dupes of Ruby in the summon session. Um, and if we get a dupe of him, you know, that'd be nice, but you know, it's gonna take eight years and right now Dark Lunas are pretty much, I would say for Blake, I kind of want to max her out because she's a collab unit, she's dark and it would be cool to have her max out. So I wouldn't want to put on him, but though he seems cool. I, I'm definitely looking forward. So hopefully you guys, uh, I don't know if you guys are looking for any of these characters, but remember, I always say it. Every time there's a banner, make sure you check your events and make sure, so if you guys have any Karens, Damians, Esna, Verdandi, if you get Adrian, of course, Ruby, Edwin, and Claude's, there's crystals to get, guys. So just so you guys know, every time there's a banner, if you have dupes of those characters, that's why I save all my dupes for that reason. So I'll be getting some free crystals. Let's do a lunatic. I thought this was a knight's ticket. It is technically summoning, so see what our luck is for the day fire so right now oh no i don't have to give that to sender who would i even give that to i have no idea who i would ask you to give that to right now a fire luna and let's see what our luck is like six star sr ssr it's a good way to start off the luck engine see where we're at for the day and our luck's looking crap i never got an ssr off of that so that's just a free limit break fine now that we got the bad luck out the way let's get to the main course shall we now, this guy's um, stuff seems really, really good. Like, I really like his kit. I would definitely want to see how the shackles work, though. Seems a little loud to me. Just gonna turn it down a little bit. All right. And another reason why I want a full pull on this banner is because <laughs> I don't do arena enough to get the awaken. I think you're supposed to get that awakening thing every week. So you're supposed to be getting 20 awakens every week, but I just can't be bothered. I also can't be bothered to extend my inventory. All right, I found the perfect target for my fire thing. I'm gonna give it to Jabanyan. He's like actually one of my favorite collab characters. And I use him a lot. He's really good in Kali Dungeon. He's really good in a lot of things. So we're gonna give it to his S3, make it stronger. And we're back. All right, let's get back into the mix. Got a couple more rounds in us. Haven't got any luck, but we usually get luck after clearing the hero box. Oh my God, this is, I don't know. Maybe because I said that I was actually gonna do a full summon. The game's like, well, if you're gonna do it already, I guess we don't have to, you know, push you along. <laughs> so I'm a little concerned right now. Oh, baby. So here we go. So for the people that are always complaining about my luck and, and how it is, what is that? Three, well, I had 22, right? So we spent 800, so that's four summons, right? Yeah, that looks correct. Four summons so far. So, hey, man, you don't always, you don't always get it the way you want it. You don't always get it the way you want it. The only difference is how you act when you don't get it. Don't be popping up on the forums and saying, you know, this is unfair and I deserve this and this. I wonder what we're gonna get for that. 
Nice, finally finished off uh, Claude's S3. And I think now we're gonna work on his S1 because they did change it. Yeah, his S1 now when it's maxed out, you get to hit four targets instead. So making a little bit better and then two for two turns. And then I don't think I cared about this. Yeah, no, so we're going for the S1. Free crystals, guys. And for Edwin, we're gonna finish off his lovely S2. Well, not in this, but we're, I'm trying to. <laughs> I feel like all Awakened characters, you can always keep their dupes because they're always gonna come back on a banner. That just seems to be the case. For Karen, we're working on that S1, baby. That 20% heal every time she counters and multi-strikes and, woo, spicy. And we're back. All right, let's keep going, baby. Nothing to it but to do it. Hopefully you guys, I only reason why I keep that in there, I'm not trying to extend the length of the video. I'm trying to force the SSR to come out, baby. Come on, Adrian! Edwin. Do we, oh, we just did two Edwins actually, so I don't really need another dupe of him, so he'll just kind of sit there. Well, actually this would finish out our S, uh, S2, right? But, wait, wait, hold on, did he bring a friend to the class? No, he didn't. All right, so the reason why I've been showing that is because a lot of people seem to not know like how to, one, use Lunas, and two, they don't seem to know, you know, why I keep my dupes the way I do. A lot of people, I've even had a question, like, do I use dupes? Do I use Evo Mons for dupes? Do I use them for dupes or do I just purple star units? Always just worry about unit progression. Skill ups is just like a nice little fun accessory that you can get but really really can wait for like eight years you don't really have to skill up anything unless you have like a full set and then you're gonna like go from level one to either level three if it has a level three aspect to it or something of that nature let's just pop that while we're whoop, let's go over there pop the sr ssr ticket you know mix up the luck so we got edwin so far and i guess we'll count this because it technically is the ssr um, so, Elizabeth dupe, interesting. Definitely gonna hold on to that because I'm pretty sure she'll come back on banner. I think she was just on banner though, was she not? I feel like she was just on a banner. Maybe she was on um, Aurora's banner. But she'll definitely come back around, so I'll hold on to that. I need to see where she's at actually too. Okay, baby. All right, all right, Elizabeth opening, because Elizabeth my boo, so she opened the pathway to Leafa? I mean, I know you you probably, you know, you want the dark skins to stay together, you know, you was like, yo, me and my me and my, my my boo, we need to we need to but but she's she's not meta right now. But but she does have a special skin and I definitely need to double check on what that is. But did she bring a friend? No, she didn't. Bring in Theo. No one wants Theo. And we're back. We got two more summons to do, and then we'll have our boy, and then I'll probably give him like uh the what I have I think I have a three star enhance. So make them purple really quick. So let's see if we can get some luck. We're already this deep. Usually if I get into the third tier, I pretty much have to finish it. It's kind of like, you might as well. You're gonna get the crystals over time, it's fine. Also the month is resetting. So, you know, being in the content creator program, I will actually get a, a nice little boost of being in the content creator program every time there's a new month. So I can kind of, not that I'm splurging here, but you know, last one. Can we get a double, which is pretty much the free one, and, well not free, we definitely spent 2k crystals here, so it's not free, but you know, get it here, and then also get it in the thing, so with one dupe, huh? Por favor? Por favor? Mmm, Sarah. Oh, Sarah, Sarah smiles. Oh my god, I forgot the band that sings that. It's a really good song, though. Sarah, actually one of my favorite characters in the game. Really want to do a guide and utilize her. She's a hybrid, fire hybrid. Really cool character. And that's it, boys. So don't, don't talk to me. Wow, Jess pops up again. He's like, I love you, Sarah. So don't, don't talk to me, guys. It happens. You summon, you don't get what you want. You have to go 2K crystals in the hole. It happens. Now, what you need to do at this point or at this point, from my point of view, I would have to then just save up, hopefully within two or three weeks, and with the resets and all this stuff, I'll be ready for the next character when they come out. If they are not out, let me just remind you guys, because I feel like a lot of people, they start some, if you don't have 2K crystals, 
and you do not plan to fully summon on the banner, do not summon. I'm, I, I can't stress this enough. Do not summon unless you are planning to have 2k crystals to make sure that you get the pity. You will be pissed and no one will feel sorry for you. <laughs> I won't feel sorry for you. But yes, be prepared. Um, even if I didn't have 2,000 crystals, I would then make sure that before the banner ends, I will eventually have it. Like, that's what I do. I just, so if you ever see a video of me like, oh, I got 1,700 crystals or 1,600 or wh whatever, I know that I'm gonna spend another 600 crystals by the time it ends, which is usually, as you guys can see here, two weeks. So I'm gonna get that in two weeks. And so look at these people getting Adrian. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope it was educational for those. I do try to sometimes throw in tips for newer people. And I feel like sometimes people that have been playing for a long while that still complain about issues and situations. And I try to enlighten them on things like that. Remember guys, it's only a 4% chance to get an SSR. 4% is higher than other games, but still it is very low. So please, don't don't get twisted when you don't get a character. It's a four percent chance. You probably have a better chance playing the lotto. <laughs> you don't. I'm mean, just you know it's one of those things where it sounds really good, but I, I'm pretty sure you don't. I actually don't know the lotto chances. But what I do know is that every day at the casino is your lucky day, and I will see you guys in the next video. Comment below if you want that to be Basker or Adrian. Your choice.